Police Minister Becky Tele ensures the safety of voters for May 29th. He will be deploying thousands of cops across the country to each voting station to ensure the safety and security of voters. Hi everyone, my name is Inga Stoffels from Cape Town, South Africa. Now we know that voting days can get out of hand in areas that are passionate about politics and passionate about where they want to see the future of South Africa going to. Now, Tele, together with the top brass in his ministry, has however managed to craft a strategy to ensure both politicians and voters are safe during the May elections. Now, on Sunday night, the Justice, Crime Prevention and Security Cluster briefed the nation on the state of readiness for the upcoming 2024 general elections. Tele also highlighted forming a special team dealing with political violence in KwaZulu-Natal. Now, the team has since expanded its operations to other provinces and achieved significant success in its mission. Minister Tele also emphasized that every voting station will be included. The ministry has pledged to do everything necessary to protect individuals participating in the democratic process and uphold the integrity of the electoral system. Now, also in a related story, Briefly News reported that Police Minister Becky Tele will hold a series of meetings in KwaZulu-Natal to enforce community-orientated policing strategies. Tele wants to connect the police with the communities throughout the province to improve safety. And people are loving this idea because his engagements are going to be prioritizing tackling crime, ensuring justice for victims, and also targeting illegal firearm positions. Let's see what South Africans had to say about this. Someone says, to be honest, he is right. He is right now. There is an improvement. With regards to elections, someone said desperate times are upon us. Even the police are telling us what to do in cases of lost IDs. Someone mentioned that I must say policing in South Africa is now kind of improving. They are at least fighting. And then another comment coming in, someone saying, I hope this team will assist and it will work in combating political killings. Now, these are the comments of some South Africans coming in over there. And as you know, we would like to hear your thoughts. We will be keeping you up to date with everything happening in SA. And we would like to hear your thoughts on this topic. Comment in the comment section and let us know what you think.